Hello, welcome to studentlearning.in, your e-learning buddy. Welcome back to our channel guys. If you are new to this channel, please make sure to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to join the family. So today class agenda is wear clothes in sash environment. So for this, first we can create a data set and the data set name is Mahi. Mahi is your data set name. After that, just declare all the variables with the input keyword like input like name name is a string that means you can define dollar sign in front of name next is section section is again a string because there is section in terms of a b c d so you can also define a dollar sign in front of section and then third one is score score is a integer values in this case there is no need to define any dollar sign because score is integer values after that just use data lines for input as the data lines or you can use card statement after that you can insert multiple records like this suppose record number one like Tom second number Raj, Ram, Atul, Sumit, Namit, Kapil, Mohit, Deep, Deepak so there are multiple records and that changes like A section, section B, sum of section C after that we can just use run command to execution after we can select the entire code and press submit for execution so you can see the table is created and in this table there are nine records so our next task with the help of where clause suppose you want to select only section a students so select all the students from section a so what we can do for this we can just write where clause for this very simple just use data then again use another data set for example next data set name is mahi1 then use set command set command is basically used to set the data of previous data so just write set command and mention the previous data set name previous data set is mahi because mahi contain all the records in terms of name section and score and then terminated by semicolon and use where section eq equal a and then use a run and then terminate it so with the help of this command you can show all the records of section a just select and execute this one so you can see now in the table format there are four records Tom, Raj, Atul and Mohit just because because the section of Tom, Raj, Atul and Mohit is belongs to A sections so this is a very simple queries in case of where clause suppose there is another case suppose I want to select all the records from section A and section V what we can do for this we can simply write data and create new data set like Mahi to set use your previous data set that is mahi after that we can use where clause like where use column name column name is section use operator in operator so with the help of in operator you can select all the records of section a and section b a b after that terminate by semicolon and then use run command and then terminate by semicolon and then select the entire code start with mahi2 to run command and then execute so you can see in the results all the records are available whose section is either a or b that means this is the another scenario of where clause so I think one more scenario in case of where clause suppose I want to display all the records whose score is between 50 to 75 for this what we can do simply we can write another code data mahi 3 this time set your default table like mahi is your default table then use where clause where and the column name is code 
and we can use again different kind of filter this operator name is between 50 and 70 terminate and run and again select and execute so records is available in this results all the records between 50 and 60 6, 50 and 75 score or 50 or 70 score as per your code so there is one more scenario in case of where that is very simple for example there is a data set data set name is like dc dc is your data set name and there is a three variables like name section score name and section is a string variable that's why we can define dollar sign in front of name and age the score is integer so in case there is no need to define anything and then data lines so these are few records suppose in some scenario there is a name is Amit and section is not defined there is another record like Sony and section is also not defined so our next task is very clear this is the table we can check select and run you can see there is a few records in case of Sony in case of Amit this section is missing so our task to find out all the records whose section is missing or we can say that suppose you want to select only those observation in which student did not fill their section information for this what we can do we can simply write data and use new data set name like dc1 and then set use previous data set that is called dc and use where clause where section use is missing statement is missing is very important aspect of says with the help of this command we can find out all the missing observations and then use run command after that we can select all the code like this and execute buttons so you can see just two record is available because these two record Sony and Amit this section is not filled so this is the different scenario in case of is missing statement with where clause suppose there is another scenario you want to select only those observation in which student filled their section information for this what we can do we can simply write data dc2 set dc where section is not missing after that we can select and run so you can see all the record in which student fill their section information this is the result there is another scenario suppose there is a record like in this case we can add few records like Rahul C 77 Lahul B 87 Ahul section A 88 so our task is now different in this case I want to select only whose observations in which student name contain HUL so for this we can simply write data like DC 3 set DC where name contains single code HUL semicolon and then use run command after that we can just select the entire code and execute the so first one is first code execute and now second one 
is just execute this one so you can see there are three records available rahul lahul and ahul because hul hal is available only like uh, lahul ahul and rahul so now i am going to explain another scenario of where clause in where clause there are two type of special character or we can see it's a wild card character wild card character is like a percentage sign suppose i want to select all the students whose name start with s so for this simply write data dc4 set dc where name like is a function single code s and percent sign and then use done command so with the help of this command we can find out all the records whose name start with s so we can execute again you can check so there are two records only in data set sony and sumit whose name start with s we can check there is two records sony and sumit whose name start with s so this is the exact scenario of where clause in sas environment thank you so much for watching please leave your questions in the comment section down below make sure to like share and subscribe to student learning check out more courses from us and follow us on instagram facebook twitter basically everywhere the link is always in the description we will be back with more lectures stay tuned and have a good day bye